Season 2 of The Traitors has delighted audiences with nonstop intrigue involving murders, poisonings, banishments, backstabbing, and MJ walking very, very awkwardly backwards out of a room. But the Peacock reality competition series, which wraps up tonight at 9 p.m., has also been notable for something else, the outlandish and impeccable fashion statements made on a weekly basis by its master of ceremonies, Alan Cumming. Parading around in ensembles that would make his good wife character Eli Gold blush, Cumming has turned the reality TV grand entrance into an art form. To honor the spectacle, we asked the host stylist on the show, Sam Spector, to share the inspirations for Cummings' most killer looks of the season, including two sneak peeks from tonight's finale. Death becomes him if you're ranking Cummings' looks from season two, and why wouldn't you be? Then this is numero uno for the stylist. The funeral look is by far my favorite, says Spectre. Deliciously layered, the cape adds so much drama as Alan leads the players down a funeral procession. Seeing red, the show starts with a Scottish splash, says Spectre. The plaid cape was a last-minute addition to really drill in the Scottish influence right off the bat in episode one. The cuffs of the jacket were hand-bedazzled to elicit the fire in the first dramatic mission. Peacocking. One of our personal favorite ensembles from this season is positively for the birds. While the contestants were busy making silly bird calls in this episode, Alan was quite literally covered in birds. I made this silly peacock hat, and the ostrich feather blouse wasn't quite enough so we added more feathers to create more drama. The Wicker Man. I took the sleeves from two different plaid blazers and added them to the body of a third to create this scarecrow-inspired look, reveals Spectre. The Wicker Headpiece was created by the brilliant milliner Gigi Burris and perfectly references the straw on a scarecrow. I accessorize a lot of Alan's looks with dramatic eyewear. Dr. Hell yes someone get Alan coming a fluffy white cat to pet. We went all in on Bond villain here, Spectre notes. And the mission in this episode had the contestants literally digging for gold, so I found a metallic gold blazer here. I further accessorized the look with mesh gloves beaded with spiders to dial in on the spookiness of the murder mystery series. Positively beautiful, oh, the intrigue. We have our first look at the host in the finale, and it's a doozy. In the finale, Alan dramatically exits a helicopter as a British gentleman. We wrapped him in a tweed sash to resemble Scottish fly plaid and gave him a wire eyeglass to complete his look. Drama. The Cape Crusader question, has anyone ever not looked fabulous in a cape? Coming will certainly finish the season in style courtesy of this head-turning finale get-up. As Alan walks in the room, he makes the whole place shimmer in this hand-bejeweled cape reimagined from the first season.